You know, believe it or not, about 10 years ago, there was actually a deck that was just as toxic as Mystic Mind decks. That's right, Final Countdown. What this card does is it says you pay 2,000 life points, and then after 20 turns have passed after you activate this card, you win the duel. So effectively, you would play Final Countdown, a bunch of cards in your deck to dig for Final Countdown, like Potter Duality, and then the rest of the cards were just protection wall-up cards that skipped your opponent's battle phase until 20 turns had passed. So Wabaku, Threatening Roar, and of course, powerful cards like Swift Scarecrow that all said skip your opponent's battle phase until 20 turns had passed. This deck was very, very, very annoying and actually topped a lot of competitive events like YCSs and Regionals. There were also powerful draw spells like Hope for Escape that says you draw a card for every 2,000 points of differential between you and your opponent's life points, which was made easy when Final Countdown did half the work. And of course, this busted spell card, One Day of Peace, which says both players draw a card and neither player takes any damage until the next turn. Yeah, this deck was very scary.